Bless up, bless up, bless up. Wagwan over Yasso on RM TV review. Hope everyone doing good as you're watching this right now. So Spice revealed that the relationship with her ex Rastaman, you know, wasn't fake at all. For all those people who are saying that, you know, them never in a relationship, them relationship did fake and a lot of things people are saying out in the media. Some people are saying them still there together, but them just a keep it off the media. Some people are saying need to get back to Spice over on his page. And also on Spice page, we see some people are say, you know, she need to get back with him. It's like some people, you know, them just see the relationship, love it, you know, and admire and thing. So it's like, based on how Spice at all now, me not think she and Rasta a get back together at all. Spice speak. First thing first, we are gonna feature a song from Wesley Diamond, Seven Days a Week. Seven days a week, non stop till daylight. Man, I work so the Nero office, dear right. Work so, Wesley Diamond over Yasso with his new song, Seven Days a Week, you know. Motivation out there, you know, from your love work. You are gonna relate to this one right here. I love how the artist deal with the flow. You know, it's like him put him all in this one, him emotion. So, you know, say the lyrics connect, you know, the message connect way my talk about in the song. It's like him encourage people say, yo, don't give up from your work and stay consistent. You have to make it in a life. So, you can check out the full song after watching this video. Okay, so back to the topic on Spice right here. You know, recently. We see Spice, she came out in the media and, uh, you know, she tell her story, what happened to her, let her fans know straight up, you know, her health condition and what took place with her over there in DR. So, Spice get emotional during the Instagram live and, you know, at the end, she just uh, talk to her fans, a reason with them and a laugh and thing and, you know, as so comes, the relationship argument came up, you know, it's like Spice... Let the people them know straight up that she's single and the type of man that she looking for. You know, I saw everybody start to talk about Rasta from there. You know, a lot of people were wondering what going on with the relationship between Rasta and Spice. Because, you know, even when Spice came out with the picture looking pregnant, a lot of her fans rush over Rasta page. You know, Rasta... Him no normally post regular, so him post something like three weeks ago, and just couple days we see a lot of comments on his page saying congratulations, oh you get spice pregnant, a lot of things. As I can see, some of the comments right here. This person post, I came here fast as soon as Spice post her preg picture. I thought Rasta has done same. <laughs> An person right here comments saying. Poor Rasta, the people them come over here yeah, for bother you about Spice Baby. So, me I tell you, a lot of comments we see, you know, over Spice, not over Spice page, over Rasta page, you know, them bam rush the man comment section after him post a picture three weeks ago and Spice, you know, she put that out few days ago. It's like people, you know, them always accommodate Rasta whenever it necessary based on some things we see Spice in, you know, controversy. Same way like when Spice was hospitalized last year, a lot of people we see rush over Rasta page, you know, and say, oh, them need to get back together. They might ask him what happened to Spice. It's like, you know, Spice settle it right here and make people know that she's single. You know, she repeat it over and over in this video we have coming up. So, it's like Spice and Rasta, we can confirm it now that they are no longer together. You see me? And Spice speak about her relationship and all of them things there. So, check out this video right here where Spice speaking about the type of man which she want and, you know, certain things she now put up with. So, I don't know. Probably Spice just put this out because she see all of the comments that people are putting up, you know, with she and the Rasta. Same way like when Spice was in the hospital. Spice supposed to see the things them, you know, and just a laugh. So check out this video right here and the people jump in the comment section. Let me know what y'all think. And nobody cannot tell me different, like my relationship with God. Like my testimony can already tell you that me have a relationship with God. 
But I'm not going to rush to baptize if I know I'm not 100% ready. Like 80% of me can go get baptized because I live in his truth. I live in his word. You know, I'm a strong believer. But what I'm to the next 20% when no say me have a fuck before me married. Like what I'm to the other 20% when no certain look at things. Every time I talk one bad will come out of my mouth. Like there's so many things to this that it's not an overnight thing. But I'm taking my walk. And I know that the day will definitely come because I'm a woman of God. I'm a strong believer, but I'm not going to run and jump and get baptized until I know for a fact, say me 100% ready for take that walk there. Me 100% ready for take that journey there because enough people jump up and run going to church and me and Uno and God know say, Uno never ready. And uh, only not ready. And then it'll become a new sense to people and make people have this bad things for say about Christian. I only do it, you know, and nobody else I only do it. But I'm not gonna walk that walk until I know that I am one hundred percent ready to walk that walk. Yeah. Me know what did me say I'm gonna find them look or something there. Yeah, come let me look at sex and them something. So when me gonna take up myself no. <laughs> me not gonna tell me. <laughs> Why, Jesus, I love you. Mm -mm. Oh, God. Yeah, Christianity is a strong and powerful thing. You have to be ready, you know. Um, and I know that, you know. Me know my little things I want me to do. Who just go and know what I want to do? What for no little things I want to do? Nobody watch me and comment about me. Worry about yourself. Mm-hmm. When I have to worry about it step because trust me, I tell you, though. Hey, God, when God comes, a different story. Um, vice is just too real. And the truth, but the truth, when am I going to take up myself? No. I'm going to act like. Because I could act like. A lot of people act like. A lot of people act like. But, oh, me, I'm going to take up myself. Eh? I run, go say me, I go dip myself now in the water and say me, I baptize. And like me, I mock God. That I would have mockery. When God is ready for me to baptize, he's going to send my husband. He's going to send um, a man of God, a man that believes in God. Um, because I know he's going to send my husband because he already knows say. Me a go on look a sex and so. So if God don't know say <laughs> you know me not end the live the other way. Yeah? Me go, hey, go. Me go come on for the live. Yeah? We're gonna leave this conversation for another day. Let me just end this live. Because if God already don't know my little heart's desire, I all the little things them women need. And I'll say me go on look a sex and so. Then him know him go place the right man, the right husband in my life so that. The little part there in my mind where I go wonder and think about sex. Because somebody in Christian church is a woman in the <laughs> Why? I love you guys. I'm not going to make my first life come back into my second life. I'm going to leave it right there. I want to come off of this life because I don't want to go back to my old self. Just know that I love you guys. Um... And that, um, that was my testimony that I shared with you guys. That was what Jesus did for me. Um, just know that I appreciate it. Just know that I appreciate you guys, that I love you guys, that I'm grateful for the priors. Just know that I shared my testimony and that was it. And just know that my song is out today and it's called God Bless Me. Just run over YouTube and go watch the video. Um, Kem Kem, I love you. Me already big you up already, boy. You're late, but you will see the live coming. No, they're going to share it all about. Um, I just can't help myself. It's just who I am. I just have to be me. I just have to be real. I just have to just just who I am. I can't wait to see you guys. Come on, get ready for me. I come out next week. I can't say. I can't wait. I'm so excited. I have a new show, new performers. Um, yeah, that's just what it is. Um, how long are you gonna perform in um April eight? One hour. I normally perform for one hour. My set is so big, I have to be cutting out a lot of my catalogs in my performance, and I don't like that. So I'm actually trying to plan like a live where I can gather all the songs that I've done and do a live performance, and uh, everybody can just do warm in and them comfort at them home and watch my performance. Doing all of my songs from the start of my career. That's really a plan that I have to go live, and I, I pray that you guys will appreciate that. But I'm planning that soon. Um what are the questions? How tall are you? I am actually five. I think I'm five feet or five one. I don't know. I'm very short. Um, 
Yes, I am single. Single, ready to mingle. But I am, um, I am at a place in my life. I don't date boys. So all of you guys who's in my DM trying to do her, I don't date boys. I don't date boys. I am um, moving forward. I want to date a man who knows his worth. I'm, I don't even want to go into that. I'll talk about that on next live. But yes, I'm single. I'm not with anyone at the moment. Not a man. For a reason. Because again, I know found it up on Instagram. I fear kind of act like when I'm happy with the man and the man I don't know all kind of things. I don't settle. I'm a very no nonsense type of person. I'm not gonna settle. I'm not gonna fake. I can fake and I could have fake, but no, me living am I real? So if something is right in my spirit, if something is settle with me, if something is right with me, trust me. Me don't know. It's not going to work.